tonight, and the plan is pizza waffle bombs. Yes, you heard that correctly. Pizza waffle bombs. I don't know how this is going to work, but the idea is I'm going to make little dough balls, pizza dough balls, filled with pizza accoutrement, and then I will throw it in my waffle maker, and then I will butter it with garlic and herb butter, and then, as any Midwestern family does on a pizza night, we'll dip it in ranch. Let's make this shit and hope it's good. I'm gonna open one can of pizza dough and pop it right on this sill pat and spread it out like I would if I was making real pizza, except I'm not. I'm making pizza dough bombs. Some with pepperoni, some with just cheese because half of my family doesn't like pepperoni and by half of my family, I mean three fourths of my family does not like pepperoni. Spread out. Slice this shit into squares. I don't know how big. Don't ask me these questions. I don't have answers for you. Well, that was very uneven. Let's see if we can't fix that. Like this, except next time, make squares instead of these weird ass shapes that I made. Open your pot pizza sauce. Preferably not with slimy hands. Spank it if you must. And I'm going to put a dollop of sauce in the middle of each rectangle situation. Next up, mozzarella cheese, because I bought way too much mozzarella cheese, like four bags over the last week and a half. What is wrong with me? I wasn't even planning on making this. On top of each pizza bomb, I'm going to take some cheesening. It's just basically Parmesan cheese and Italian seasoning and probably some, oop, don't do too much, be careful. Gingerly, Jessica, gingerly. Now I'm gonna make them into balls. That's kind of like a pizza bomb. Most things are tucked within the inside. That's yeah, like so. A little baby pizza dough ball. And I'm gonna throw it inside of my waffle maker and hold my breath. Ooh. I'm gonna put it right in the middle. I don't think it's gonna get that big, but I wanna, I wanna, I wanna properly press it down. While that's cooking, let's make the rest into balls. There has been a breach in this one. So we'll, we'll see if that's okay. Our first bomb is done cooking in the waffle iron, which is a weird sentence, but it looks good. Let's just repeat this process. And I'm going to make another batch of bombs, filling them with mozzarella and pepperoni. I have now made three pizza bombs and I'm going to butter them with this garlic and herb butter while they are still hot. I have fresh Parmesan that I'm going to grate atop my pizza bombs. And let's take a look and see if they're even good. It's hot. Mmm, that is so good. But of course they're good. I made it. Follow along for more aggressive tutorials. That is seriously so good. You wanna try some, baby? Mm. 